Let's go through the Sunum Tau form. Go ahead, stand tall. Chamber the arms, bend the knees, pivot on the heels, pivot on the toes. Cross tan, cross gone, cross tan. Chamber, left fist, strike. Right fist, strike. Palm up, hand. Breathe in deep and exhale. Look around to Wu Sao. Breathe in. Exhale. Fuk Sao. Bridge on hand. Breathe in. Exhale. Down and back up. Breathe in. Exhale. Bridge on hand again. Breathe in. As you're breathing in, push the elbow forward. There we go. And then drop your hand down and up to a move position and draw the elbow back. Let's do one more. Fook. Breathe in deep. Exhale. So as you're doing this, you're gonna put a little bit of pressure on that forearm. So it should be straining a little bit, shoulder down. Down and up. And breathe in. And out. Great. Now from here, sideward palm, palm strike. And repeat the same thing on the right side. Right hand opens up. This is the palm up or tan sao. Breathe in and out. And back, wu sao. Breathe in and out. Bridge on hand, breathe in, and out. Down on and up, breathe in, and out. Fook so again, breathe in, and out. Down and up, breathe in, and out. Cyber palm, palm strike. Palm hand up, pull the hand back, turn and rotate down, roll those fingertips up, snap the fist shut. Chamber, let's go into the next section. Left gum sao, right gum sao, rearward gum sao, which means pinning, forward pinning, barricading, whisking, barricading arm, sinking, palm up, Jerk, thrusting fingers, long bridge pinning, lifting, and chamber. Sideward palm, lying palm. Jin Sao, sideward palm, lying palm. Jin Sao, Hai Tan, Jut, Guat, Lao. Lower lying palm, Jin, back. Hai Tan, Jet, Guat, Lao, lower lying palm, back. Bong Sao, Tan, reverse. Wing, palm up, reverse palm. Extend the hand out, tut, two, Three, punch, two, three. When practicing at home, I want you to keep a few things in mind. First of all, it's gonna be your footwork. 
Make sure you're practicing a good character two position, which means your toes are in and your heels are out. And use your legs and squat down into that position to really engage the quads. In section one of the Sunum Tao, where we're doing the Tan and back and the Wu, I want you to practice your breathing. So make sure you're practicing mindful breathing, which brings your breathing in deep, down into your stomach, and then exhaling, breathing out. You can practice this. The purpose of this is to get a kind of a meditative feel to it, to get you ready to work out. In section two, the movements are gonna be a little bit faster and snappier. In fact, I usually like to make sure they're really brisk, clear movements. When you're doing that, you wanna make sure you're going from one movement to the next, going from gum sow, gum sow, back, hitting those points rather than going through and on to the next, like this. I don't want to blur them together. Keep them separate. You can practice them fast, but keep them separate. Don't gloss over any of the movements. All right. Well, I wish everybody good health, and I want you all to remember that Kung Fu is for everybody. Bye.